Hi, Coach Tom Avery here. One of my subscribers uh, posted a comment saying, Tom, what do you mean about point number four? And point number, <clears throat> number four was all about aiming higher on the second serve, on the kick serve. So he's Spanish, so it's apuntar mas alto, apuntar mas alto, aim higher. Now you notice I have some X's on the back fence. These X's there are probably up about uh, six, seven feet so I want you to aim there when you're hitting this topspin serve. Now, first of all, you have to have a continental grip or an eastern backhand. Continental or eastern backhand. Continental is going to be here where the index knuckle and the palm of the hand are on number two. That's continental. Or eastern backhand where you move them to number one. Either you're going to be on two or one. Okay, so once you have the grip, you've got the continental grip or the eastern backhand, you don't want to toss the ball too high. If the ball is tossed too high, the racket will not be rising into the ball. Okay, if the ball's way up there, the racket's all played out and you cannot impart the spin. So don't toss the ball too high, just to the peak of your reach, slightly over your head so you can get a good angle as you're coming up to get the top spin. And I want you to visualize the ball leaving your strings ascending. There. I want you to visualize when you brush, when you brush up, the ball is ascending off of your strings. Now this is not necessarily what happens, but I want you to visualize that. Okay, so I want you to think of the ball ascending off your strings. Now to start it off, I want you to swing in slow motion, okay, about 25% of your normal speed or 50% and I want you to aim very high over the net. Okay, so I'm aiming very high there. I'm looking at the X's and I'm swinging very slow and just going up. You can see how that ball kicks up there. Okay, this is a good way to get the feel for it by swinging slow and aiming very high over the net. Looking at those X's. So I don't worry about hitting long. You want the ball to be clearing the net by four or five feet. So if you hit long, that's okay. Swing slow, aim high. Okay, after you've done that for five or ten minutes and you're starting to get that nice arc on your serve, then you're going to go full speed. You're going to swing as fast as you do on your first serve. Okay, let's take a look in slow motion. As the hands drop, the weight goes to the rear foot. And now as the hands come up, the weight will go to both feet platform position right there. Now, right now I'm thinking vertical. 
Notice the ball toss is over the head, and I'm just thinking straight up. I'm swinging straight up almost, and the racket was rising there. Look at the net clearance here. It's not quite at the net, but look at how high the ball is. It goes over the net probably about four feet at least, maybe five. And I get a decent kick. Not like I used to, but not bad. Okay, now even though you're swinging just as fast or faster than your first serve, the ball will have less speed. You're not compressing the ball as much. You're putting more energy into the brushing and spin. Okay, another look in slow motion. The hands come back. Weight goes to the rear foot. Now as the hands come up, I'm going to go to that platform position when the knees bend right there. Now I'm pushing up, swinging vertical. The racket is on edge right there. The racket is rising. The ball is dropping slightly so I can get that racket rising on the ball. That's going to give me spin. And I'm thinking vertical. Again, look at the net clearance. That ball there is close to going over the net right there. It's about four or five feet at least over the net. Again, decent kick. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Please subscribe to the channel, give us a thumbs up, and share it with your friends. Remember, the key to a second uh, serve, a topspin kick serve, is going to be aiming higher. Relying on the spin to pull the ball down quicker. Toss the ball lower so your racket is still rising. That's going to be key as well. All the best, guys. Have a great one.